Hey guys, I'm in uh, Johnson City, Tennessee here. I just got done doing some volunteer work for Team Rubicon, cleaning out some houses um, after the floods down here and I ended up getting COVID, so I'm stuck in a hotel here and while I had a few minutes, I figured I'd make you guys a video uh, explaining the tattoo that I got, or the tattoos that I got recently. So um, let's see if I can get some good footage of the whole thing first. First I started off with this one here. Right, one up here. Let's see if I can get that all the way around the side, maybe. Kind of hard to see. Let's see if I can get a good angle. There we go. And the underside here. side of this so he yeah, has to start off of course the night because our last day of night because I've always kind of thought of myself as a knight in shining armor it was always kind of a joke and I've always tried to live my life life that way but then on the shield you know, of course, based on the game we used to play when I had the pickup truck, if you guys recall, I think it was the Black Dodge Ram that I had, had a compass on it, and whenever we would drive around picking you guys up from, or, yeah, picking up and dropping off from daycare in Manchester at your mom's old work there, um, we used to go, if you're going, you know, west, we'd be going Will's Way, if you're going south, we're going Sam's Way, and... Um, you know, east was Rowan's way and Jackson's was north. So I translated that into an actual compass on the shield here. And the meaning, the second sort of meaning behind that is that you guys really are so important to me that you guide me in pretty much everything I do. And I don't, probably don't say it enough or explain it enough. Or, but yeah, you guys are my compass. You guys help guide me and, and point me in the right direction all the time. And so that's kind of what that means. You guys are everything to me. And the second half of this tent, well, first of all, the sort of the, the back part of this with the horse, that was kind of just filler. Um, the tattoo artist kind of came up with that. i got to think of something because I do like the horse, but I don't really have a great meaning for it at this point. But the ruins, sort of these busted up castle pieces were meant to be sort of my past, my history. Of things that I've done, you know, places that I've been, um, jobs that I've had, people that I've known, things like that, that I've, you know, experienced and seen in the past, and, uh, and that's kind of where I have been and where I want to go in the future is kind of the second half of the tattoo of this castle kind of theory is that, you know, you guys help guide me to my future goals and follow this path, this windy hard road up this up this uh, this mountainous terrain through all the ruins and then get to the, the sort of the promised land so to speak in this cool awesome uh, castle at the end of the road and that's kind of the goal at the end of the day uh, as far as not necessarily a castle but you know my goals where I want to be things that I want to accomplish in my life think people that I want to help things that I want to invent businesses I want to start things like that it kind of symbolizes all that stuff um, and the moon is for mom, for my mother, and she's helped guiding me as well. And then the, the eagle on my arm, which wasn't finished yet, was for my dad, uh, who's helping also kind of guide the way and protect me along the way. He had a, the, the story behind that is he had an actual eagle tattoo on his arm. And I, nobody can really see a good picture of it. All the pictures we have are so far away, we can't really tell exactly what it was and how it looked. But um, it was some kind of an eagle from his, I believe it was his 101st Army Division that he was in. And it had our names on it, my sister's and my name. So I had Patience, Ashley, and Ben on there. And so that's kind of to commemorate uh, that tattoo as well as him. And so, yeah, 
that is it. I never got a tattoo my whole life until the age of 45 because I didn't really know what I wanted. I didn't want to put anything on it that I wasn't really uh, in tune with or that really meant a lot to me because I didn't want to have something you know, stuck on my body for the rest of my life that I wasn't going to really appreciate and love and, and always mean something to me. And so finally, you know, at this age, I kind of finally realized what it was that meant something to me. And came up with the, you know, between Jackson and I and some others, came up with the these ideas on what, what the tattoo should look like. So, yeah, that's it. Hope you guys like it. Hope you guys appreciate it and understand it. And if you have any questions about it, please feel free to ask. All right. I love you guys. I'll see you soon. Bye.